Hey guys, what's up? It's Shelby and welcome back to my channel. So today I am starting my seven days of Halloween makeup. I'm so excited for this to start. So today I'm going to be doing a kind of cute, kind of scary scarecrow. So I am so excited. Um, if you are interested, keep on watching and let's just get right into this video. I'm just going to start off and do your brows how you usually would just do them. I just did my brows off camera to save some time. And of course, you can do your foundation, your concealer, and your powder, and your base. I'm not going to just because I don't do that anyways. But um, do that and stuff and then let's just get right on to the cheeks. So I am going to take, let me see... I'm going to take my Morphe 35O palette. I need a brush. I'm going to take this shade right here, which is like a pale orange color. And I'm going to use this as my bronzer pretty much. So I'm just going to take this through all the way up. I'm going to pretty much use this as my blush and bronzer. I'm going to bring it like directly up. take an eyeshadow base and of course I'm using the Essence Eye Hard Color Eye Intensifying Eyeshadow Base just on my left. I'm going to go in with that orange shade again and I'm just going to run that through my crease first. And then I'm going to take the shade above it which is right here. And I'm just going to run that through as well. And then on my finger, I'm going to take this pale gold shade right here. And I'm just going to pop that on my lid. And that is it for the eyeshadow. Now we're going to move on to this eye. Um... I'm just gonna take a white liner to kind of stencil out where we're gonna put our triangle. So I'm just gonna mark it out. And then I'm gonna continue it down. So then I'm going to do my nose as well. So I'm just going to kind of make a little like teardrop nose. I'm going to take some white face paint and fill it in so that the um, eyeshadow just pops a little bit more when you put it on. So I'm just using a paint that I got from Walmart. Um, it's just like a water activated one. You want to make sure you're not using grease paint. You want one that sets. So... Okay, so now that that is done, we're going to go in with our orange. So I am going to go again in with the Morphe 35 O palette. I'm going to take the shade right here and I'm going to mix it with the shade below it. And I'm going to take those two shades on a packer brush and I'm just going to pack this right on top of the white.
So now I'm just going to clean up the edges. Don't worry about the outer edges because we're gonna put those in black right now actually so i'm gonna take a little brush like this and then a flat brush and i'm gonna take a black eyeshadow which does they don't have one here so i'm gonna use my jeffree star palette and take the black shade in this which is called uh fast lane and i'm just going to outline the edges of this mm, of my nose and my eye So now that it's filled in, I'm just going to take this brush and I'm going to take the gray shade called Vroom Vroom and I'm just going to start shading in kind of up here and just kind of taking this and blending out the line we made just to make it look a little bit deeper, a little smokier. A dab of the black, you want most of the black to kind of be up in this little peak area. And then drag it down the sides and then i'm doing the same thing with the gray shades i'm just bringing it and blending these out and you also kind of want darkness to kind of be like on the corners mostly So now I'm going back on this brush and taking the black and then just redefining the line. Since we just kind of blended it out, I'm just going to redefine that black line. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of the black face paint in this palette just on a little mini brush like this. And I'm going to now kind of, I don't exactly know what to call it, but I'm just going to kind of make almost like little cracks. Kind of going up like that. I'm going to outline this to make the black so that they match. And I'm also going to do the same thing on the bottom part, but I'm going to bring them down instead of up. And I think the best thing is, is to use really, really light brush strokes. And I'm going to do the same thing on the nose, but I'm only going to do the top part and I'm just going to bring them up. So I'm just going to pop on some white liner on the um, bottom waterline and some mascara on the top, but um, do I want to do the bottom and on the bottom as well. Okay, so I ended up not putting mascara on my bottom lash line. I kind of just went over it with the white eyeliner so that it, so I can put like fake ones on, so I can draw fake ones on. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do right now. So I'm just going to take my NYX Epic Ink Liner and I'm just going to draw on some lashes on the bottom lash line. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take it and pull them out. 
kind of far. Did you just see that? My hand twitched. looks so cute like it looks like doll like and i love it <laughs> okay so for the mouth i'm gonna take just a little bit of a thicker brush and i'm gonna use the black and i'm just gonna kind of make like a smile with it just going like directly on my lips like on the inner part of my lips So I took it out just about to the corner of my eye on each side mm -hmm. and then I'm going to take the smaller brush and I'm going to kind of make these little lines again and I'm just going to kind of take my brush and go like this through it first. Now I'm just going to add some more concentrated ones. Just kind of squigglier instead of straighter. All right, I'm gonna go pop on some lashes and then I will be right back. Alright guys, that is it for this video. I hope you liked it. Um, I love it. I think this turned out really cool. It's kind of cute, but kind of scary at the same time. You know what I mean? And I kind of been living for that. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know what you guys want to see next down below. Also, don't forget to follow my social medias. They are all linked down below. And I will see you guys in my next video.